Hello, welcome back to my channel. Um, I just got done getting ready for the day. Um, I'll have to show you guys my outfit. It's um, a matching sweatpants and like just a lounge wear type of set. Um, because when I came out into the living room today, it was actually raining, which is a good thing for California. We need the rain, just not every day, like, no. <laughs> so, so it only rains a little bit here, which is fine with me, um, because I need the sun, love the sun. So, yeah, so anyways, um, I came out here, it was raining, so I decided just to put on loungewear, and I'm just gonna chill for the day. I am working, and then I thought that I would put together the St. Patrick's Day coffee bar. Um, I already took down all my Valentine's Day stuff, and my coffee bar has been bare ever since, and I need it to be decorated. So I'm gonna decorate it in the St. Patrick's Day theme since that is next week, and I'm a little late to it. I should have done it in the beginning of this month, but I was just super busy. I already drank my uh, chocolate probiotic drink this morning i did not have coffee when i woke up this morning i don't know i just like some days coffee just does not like sound very good right in the morning i don't know why and i like don't get me wrong i'm obsessed with coffee but there's just a couple days where i just wake up and i think i'm just like dehydrated or something and i need water and i just i just went for the pro probiotic shake this morning so i haven't had coffee i haven't had caffeine or anything so i might look a little bit tired um and that just reminds me like somebody this weekend asked me how many cups of coffee do you drink actually like they thought i drank a whole entire pot or like three to four cups a day and it's not true um yeah i love coffee but i literally only have like one cup of coffee a day um if i go to starbucks or dunkin donuts or any other coffee place like i'll usually get a medium or a large but here at home i only do the 10 ounce uh, 10 ounces of water on my keurig so i only have one one cup of coffee so <laughs> Don't be scared or anything. It's not like I drink um, a whole entire pot of coffee because I do know some people actually when I used to bartend I ran into this guy and he told me he drank a whole entire cup of coffee Like in the morning all the way till work and everything like he would put it in a cup and take it all the way to work I think he had like a two-hour commute and then he would make another cup of coffee to come back home like uh, No <laughs> I would be like wired, which I'm already am. So I don't even know how his tolerance, like it has to keep getting higher and higher and higher. Like I also worked with this girl. <laughs> she um, used to drink 10 tea bags of tea. Like, I don't know what tea it was, but she would literally get a big bowl of water and put 10 tea bags and in, drink the whole entire tea for the whole entire shift. Like, and then I think she had tea before she came. <laughs> like, because she used to work night shifts. So I know that girl was, yeah. So anyways, I only drink one. But if you drink more than one, go for it. Um, sometimes I do have two cups of coffee. So anyways, I'm just rabbling, babbling on right now. outfit of the day it's just a matching top and bottom set i got from tj maxx uh hurley beach shack it's like a cream colored and i just put a sports bra under it it's super soft super cheap i think it was like 12.99 so i love it it's comfy i am walking to our parcel room where our mail gets dropped off like our amazon packages or anything that comes like in a box um, it's separate from like our mail, like if you get letters or bills. <laughs> so anyways, I have to walk all the way down to the parcel room. Um, our Alexa let us know that we have um, something here. Um, it's probably from Amazon. 
um, because we are an Amazon family, I swear. Like even my boyfriend's dad, like I, we get an Amazon package like every single day, almost. So does his dad. So anyways, we were walking down um, and we are also waiting for a pillow top that we just bought. We also bought it off of Amazon. We're making um, payments on it uh, because I have been having like a lot of back problems sleeping on our new bed and it's brand new. And it's a firm bed because our old bed was like too soft and that was hurting our backs. And so now we got a firm bed. He loves it and I don't. So we got a pillow top. Hopefully that helps because my back hasn't hurt in a couple years and I really don't want it to start hurting now. So I'm going to take the elevator downstairs, only one floor because we're on the second. So that's not too bad. We used to live on the third. Actually, when we moved in here, we used to live on the first, then the third. Now we're on the second. So we've moved three times. So this is what the parcel room looks like. You got two computers and all of the little spots they put their packaging. Three, nine, six, zero, three, seven. It opens right there. What is it? What could it be? Oh, I know. Ooh, I can't wait to show you guys what this is. <gasps> I'm so excited. I got this off of Etsy. Oh, I love how people package their stuff. Okay, guys, you already know it's coffee themed. <laughs> yes! Yes, look at it. Oh my God. Pink, of course. Ooh. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my God, she has more stuff. What is this? Oh, oh. Oh, it's a note. Dear Samantha, thank you so much for your order. I hope you enjoy this cup as much as I enjoyed making it. Oh. Oh my gosh, oh, she's giving me a code. Use code GLASSYGAL20 for 20% off. Oh my gosh. Guys, I will link her um, Etsy shop below because she makes the cutest um, Starbucks cups. There's just more, there's more. Oh my, goodness. oh my goodness. Okay, this is all her information in case you guys wanna get a cup yourself lid. I knew there was going to be a lid. Straw. Look at that. Oh yes. Oh yes. Another sticker. <laughs> Cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. Just a bunch of confetti. Okay. Yes. Let's put it together. All right. Look at that. Yes. I can't wait to use it. Ooh, so cute. Okay, just to show you a little bit what I got. I got this welcome sign from the dollar store. I'm just gonna put it by our front door. And then a bunch of goodies in here. My mom actually got me this coffee mug. She tries to give me a coffee mug for every holiday. It says, let the shenanigans begin. Very cute, totally me. Um, just this little decoration from the dollar store, a dollar. I don't know exactly where I got these lights, probably from the dollar store, but you just need batteries for them, so that might be, that's going to be cute. Dollar store, don't know what I'm going to do with it yet, but it's green. Target, found this for a dollar, probably will put my coffee in it. Um, Target again, honestly just got this because it's green. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted it to match. Um, also from Target, these two pillows. They were in the dollar section at Target, but I don't think they were a dollar. They might have been like three. Three dollars, maybe? Yeah. Three dollars. I'm going to put them up front by my shoe rack. And then 
candle is from Target. Honestly, you just got it because it's green and it's gonna match. And I was out of candles. And let's see, it's just another chalkboard. I think I got this at Walmart. Matching dish towels. You always need these to match the theme. A little scarf from the dollar store. I'm just gonna use it for decorations. And a sign also from the dollar store. So super cheap, gonna put it all together for you guys. to work out. I actually am not working out for like another hour and a half because my sister won't be home. So I am just going to edit um, a video and drink my protein shake. And then after the gym, I got invited to go get drinks with um, a friend. How cool because that's rare. Um, so <laughs> Like, I haven't gone out to go get drinks in forever. And I'm looking for my car. Did I have to park upstairs? No, I'm down here, okay. 
the struggle. If there's no parking in the basement, you have to go up five floors and park at the top. So the nights that I come home late, I usually have to park up at the top because all the ones in the basement are taken. But last night I got the last parking spot in the basement. So I gotta walk all the way down here. Anyways, yeah, those are my plans for tonight. I'm out of breath already. Oh, I need to go on some walks. I am trying to get 10,000 steps a day. I used to be so good at it and now it's a struggle. Since Ever since I um, started working from home, it's a struggle now. Like when I was serving and bartending, easy. But now it's not. So I have to like force myself to get 10,000 steps a day. Okay, I'm finally getting home. Um, I'm going up <laughs> to the fifth and sixth floor, of course, because it is nine o'clock. I didn't even try to go downstairs in the basement, honestly, because you go all the way down and there's no parking. So you gotta turn around and go all the way up. So I'm just going up. Anyways, it was really nice to go out with um, some friends and working out. That was good too. Katrina killed me leg day. Tomorrow is my last day for the eight weeks in a row. I've been working out three day, three days, um, a week for eight weeks. Tomorrow will be the end of that. Um, I'm still going to work out. Um, but now things are going to change because my sister did get a job at a gym. She's going to be a personal trainer and she is in school. So, um, with her new job, we are going to have to change up my, uh, my um schedule to work out um but good thing is she can bring someone free to work so i'll probably go uh to her gym and work out there but i'm just like really proud of myself for going eight weeks in a row without missing a day um and if i couldn't do that day i still made it up that week so i still did three days a week for eight weeks in a row and i'm just like so proud um what i really need to work on is <laughs> is um what i eat because yes i'm getting stronger but i'm not really getting thinner <laughs> so i'm gonna start trying to eat healthier but it was just so nice to to go out and just talk to some girls tonight um just have a one beer and just i didn't even have one beer i had literally half a pint um so <laughs> so um yeah we just sat by the fire and talked really and it, it was really nice. So um, I'm gonna go home. Uh, Kalani did tell me that our uh, pillow top came in tonight and he put it together already. So I'm super excited because my back literally hurts today. Like yesterday didn't hurt and today it hurts. So hopefully, fingers crossed, this works. Going around people. <sighs> Almost there. All right. Anyways, I'm probably gonna sign off for the night. Thanks guys for hanging out with me today and watching my videos, subscribing, liking, commenting, following me on my Instagram, any of that. I just love it. And I love when you guys ask me questions and uh, like just DM me and ask me questions about my videos or what I'm doing for the day like it just makes me so much happier and I love it so thank you everybody for watching this and I hope you guys all have a wonderful night and until then good night <laughs>